was there was a lot of pre-production to this project, but I would never be interested in playing a track that's already has all the elements coming at the time that everybody's expecting them to happen. Uh -huh. What I like is to keep the the live process of it. So everything there's a lot of besides playing this instrument sometimes and singing a bit, I was playing a lot of tracks from the computer, a lot of sounds from the computer. But I was not only deciding when I want what sound to happen, but also I built um, them together so that they interact and uh, and there's some randomness also. Like and I was feeling that. that. Yes, and watching the dancers kind of yeah. 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 On, on top of that, I felt because the world of sound is like to me the world of colors and like a painting, I, I wanted to create specific colors for that specific project. So I found it interesting to record the rehearsal and whatever sound was happening, the dancers were being about on the floor, everything. And this was material for me to, of course, with technology them into something completely different. But there's a lot of the dancers' voices, the dancers' moves, Lisa's voice. She sometimes put a percussion instrument, very hard to recognize that it's your voice, but it's there. Uh, layers of her voice, layers of the, of, the, of the environment of the rehearsal room we were in for so many days. So it, it, it's all there, and it's, it's these are the colors of the, of the music. 